Back to cut above tarot, Libra. 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 How you doing, Libra? Libra, this is your solo message, the first in this mini-series that I'm doing just for you, okay? Yeah, this series was given to me by Spirit, God Divine Source, okay? It was downloaded to me, and they told me to do it, therefore I am doing it. All right, not just for you, but for all the signs, okay? So the solo message is about those, for those that are single, uh, uh, one foot in the door and one foot out, uh, a casually date now, okay, but not actually attached to someone, all right? All right, now, this is supposed to be a love reading, however, whatever comes out is what I tell, all right? All right, but I'm going to try to stick to the, uh, to the storyline, okay, for those that are single, all right, and ready to uh, mingle. All right. Now, Libra, so far, this is what they tell me. When I pull your cards from the uh, the Love Oracle deck, they said that you are very abundant at this time. And you're trying to keep a positive mindset. All right. They said that they want you to manifest exactly what it is that you want. All right. And do it with gratitude and bliss. They also said that somebody that you were with, you are in separation from, this person wants to come back. Uh -huh. This person is sad. This person is missing you. This person is thinking about you. All right. This person may even be yearning. Okay. But uh, they're not really sure about their future with you. Okay. Or if there is a future that with you. Libra. All right. You're looking for somebody that you can talk to. You're looking for interesting, interesting conversation. All right. You want to be able to converse more with a person. You are an air sign. All right. <laughs> There are some awaited messages, some messages that you've been waiting for. They're about to come in, all right? Not only that, they are arriving. You may have something come in by text message, by email, maybe even by phone call. However, um, yeah, you you got somebody or something that's hovering over you. The Tempest card is here, Libra, and they said that they want you to continue to go with the ebbs and flows. They want you to balance your energy, all right? They don't want you to try to get ahead. They don't want you to force nothing to happen. Allow things to be as they are, okay? Just get yourself grounded. Ground your energy, okay? You do have some healing coming in, all right? All right, you're going to get, look like you're going to be doing some traveling. Or this person that you were with is doing some traveling, all right? You're putting an end to an old cycle, an old phase, okay? And you're still moving forward, okay? Yes, you are. All right. But uh, whoever this person is, this person is way in the head, okay, about you. Yeah, this person is always thinking about you. Eight of Swords, okay? You got some new opportunities coming your way, Libra. Not only that, when it comes to your finances, expect an increase. And if you are dating someone and you're trying to get a better understanding in this relationship and you're doing trying to put in a lot of communication so you can get to know this person better expect the relationship to grow okay yeah yeah it might be a little difficult for you to balance yourself because you feel like you don't have enough or if you don't have a, enough information in order for you to be able to meditate or, or, or pray or whatever this is pertaining to your abundance, okay? But it looks like you have a lot of choices at this time on what you can do, okay, to get your energy grounded, to get some balance, all right, going with the ebbs and flows. Now, there are some delays that are put in place right now when it comes to your love life, Libra. All right, just not for all Libras, but for uh, some Libras. And that is because their the spirit, God, divine source is assisting you in getting yourself in a balanced place. All right? Some of you Libras already know exactly what it is that you want, okay? You already know to continue to keep a positive mindset. All right? Use gratitude and bliss to bring in what you truly desire. Okay? Yeah. You already know that. You also know that you need to meditate, okay, in order to keep yourself grounded. You also know that through your meditation that you also bring in some healing to yourself. And you also understand that there are, sometimes there are uh, 
blockages that are put in place, all right, purposely, because there's something that you got to do, all right, for it. So you'll be strong enough to be able to make that next step, okay, and be able to bring in what you want, what you truly desire, all right. So, uh, and, and, uh, and, a, an example would be like saying that you want you a very wealthy uh, person to come in your life that'll handle all of the affairs, okay? But yet and still, you got a wealthy person that comes in your life and they can handle all the affairs, but this person is also a cheater. Yeah, you got to mean what you say. Say what you mean. Get your mindset exactly where you want. As this card says, keep a positive mindset. Manifest exactly what you want with gratitude and bliss. This is what they want you to do. Okay, Libra. All right, Libra, you got the Ace of Swords here. This Ace of Swords is talking about cutting out these people, places, and things that are no longer good for you. All right, seeing the truth. All right, uh, removing all the illusions. All right, seeing things for exactly for what they are. All right, this talking about um, uh, new beginnings and opportunities. All right. Mm -hmm. Coming in after you done went through a whole bunch of mindset of feeling like that you can't move forward or, or something is blocking. Yeah, there is a block. The block has been put here by God, by a source, purposely, okay? Because they want you to uh, to work something out, and you know exactly what that is. You got the nine of coins here. So once you work that out, because look here, you felt like you didn't have enough, but this is what's coming your way. If you are right now in a in a situation where you feel like that you don't have enough or maybe don't have enough information or you're on a, a need-to-know basis about something pertaining to your meditation, because you really don't know what's going to come out once you start meditating, right? All right, but you are meditating for your abundance, all right? And this is the results, nine of coins, nine of pentacles, and you're going to be very comfortable, okay? You're going to be content with what's starting to come your way. And it's going to flow, baby. You see seeds in this watermelon. Watermelon has many seeds. It has mature. It has some that's almost mature. It has baby seeds and it has seeds that are uh, just starting to turn into seeds. This is how you got it. It's going to come in. This is your blessing. And it's going to continue to be in like this, okay? You got, it's like uh you're planting seeds for most seeds to come in, all right, through your gratitude and your bliss, for you manifesting things exactly what you want, for keeping a positive mindset. So this is what you have to look forward to, Libra. Congratulations, and I thank you, Libra, for watching your first video in this mini-series of solo messages. Don't forget to hit that like, share, subscribe, and comment button. I'll see you in the next video. Yay, yay. Don't forget to check that notification button out and check out also our, our member section. See if there's something there over there that you're interested in. See you later.